Welcome back to my channel Iraqi Dinar Digest, I hope you are all will be fine God give you more happiness and prosperity, now, let's start with some major updates. Intel guru Frank 26 shared that Iraqi Prime Minister Sudani announced on Friday that the government is working on removing three zeros from the Iraqi dinar to increase its value and give citizens more purchasing power, with plans to achieve this by the end of the year. The next day, a statement from Bartsani in Kurdistan echoed this sentiment, confirming that Baghdad, the central bank, and Sudani's team are all aligned in this effort. There is growing speculation that this change might happen even sooner, potentially by mid-October, signaling a major shift in Iraq's currency policy aimed at strengthening the dinar. The Iraqi government has recently made a series of important decisions directly tied to the real effective exchange rate, rear a crucial indicator of a country's economic strength on the global stage. Now, the term real effective exchange rate might sound technical, but it's essentially a measure of a country's currency value against a basket of foreign currencies, adjusted for inflation. When Iraq takes steps in line with RIA principles, it signals they are working toward a more balanced and competitive position in the global economy. The government's recent moves suggest they are serious about adjusting their exchange rate to reflect the country's actual economic situation more accurately. This is major news because any changes to the exchange rate can have widespread effects, impacting everything from the cost of goods and services domestically to Iraq's role in international trade. If you've been following developments with the Iraqi dinar, you're probably aware of long-standing speculation about a potential rate adjustment. With these latest decisions, it seems we might be closer than ever to seeing that speculation become reality. The rear is particularly important because it gives a clearer view of Iraq's economic competitiveness. Unlike the nominal exchange rate, which compares one currency against another, the rear considers multiple currencies and adjusts for inflation. This makes it a more reliable gauge of how strong or weak the Iraqi dinar truly is on the international stage. What's happening right now indicates that the Iraqi government is laying the foundation for an exchange rate that reflects the country's real economic strength. Sources within Iraq's Ministry of Finance are echoing this sentiment. These moves are aligning with a broader push for ear adjustments, and insiders believe these steps could lead to a significant change in the Iraqi dinar's value. Additionally, the government is taking strong measures to tighten its financial policies, crack down on corruption, and implement reforms aimed at making Iraq more attractive to foreign investors. These are precisely the kinds of changes needed for a substantial rear adjustment. For years, Iraq has struggled with political instability, economic sanctions, and corruption all of which have hampered growth. However, these new decisions point to a shift in the government's priorities. They seem more committed than ever to stabilizing the economy, boosting international trade, and ultimately adjusting the exchange rate to reflect the true value of the Iraqi dinar. A potential change in the exchange rate could have significant consequences, not just for Iraq's economy, but also for investors in the dinar. Stay tuned as we continue to watch this unfold. On Thursday, the exchange rates of the US dollar against the Iraqi dinar remained stable in Baghdad but dropped slightly in herbal markets. According to a survey by Shafak News Agency, the dollar rate on the central Al Kafir and Al Harithiya stock exchanges in Baghdad closed at 153,800 dinars per $100, the same as the opening rate. In Baghdad's currency exchange stores, the selling rate was 154,750 IQD, and the buying rate was 152,750 IQD per 100 US dollars. Meanwhile, in Erbil, the selling price was 153,850 dinars, and the buying price was 153,750 dinars per 100 dollars.